Hey family, welcome back to Lightworks. I hope that you are blessed and well. Let's go ahead and take a few long deep breaths. I hope that you all are doing well. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you for clicking on the video. If you are returning, hey so family, what's going on? Let's get into this breathing and see what's going on in the energy. Inhale positive life force energy. Exhale and release any stress or anxiety that you may be feeling at this time. I'm hearing no rest for the wicked. Rest and rejuvenate in the reverse. Okay. Most high God, divine Holy Spirit, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, guardian angels, divine beings of the highest white light, please come in and connect with me now. Please allow me to channel the current energies for the collective. Archangel Michael, please protect our energy. Please close the door on anything that's not at the highest white light and encamp the angels of protection around myself and the collective. Please and thank you, Ashe. I am just noticing by the urgency of getting into this read that there is some urgency. It's almost like uh, I got to know right now. I got to get into it right now. And that's the energy here. I'm usually much more relaxed much, taking a lot more time to get into the breathing and clear the energy and connect with you guys um i don't even have the frequency playing in the background like i usually do <clears throat> so um i just got straight into it and i feel like this is why rest and rejuvenate on the bottom of the deck in reverse first card to come out was hostilities waiting game emotional loss and mental conflict there is some type of karmic energy that is having some sleepless nights whatever they're waiting for they're they're stressed they're in their head they're feeling like lost or they're feeling like they're about to lose something and they are pressed and stressed okay so let's get into this energy and see what is going on archangel michael anything that's not of the highest white light we ask that you would block it destroy it remove it transmute anything that we can sustain into love light and positivity anything else please return it to where it belongs what's hostilities the moon on the bottom of the deck this person is needing to know something. Ten of Cups. King of Cups. Someone could be stressed and pressed about your stability. This person could be feeling like they don't have stability with the Four of Wands in reverse. Please keep in mind that all of these readings are for entertainment purposes only. This is a general reading and not a personal reading, so it may not apply to you. Take only what resonates with you and leave the rest. Also, if anything should come up in regards to mental health, which I am feeling that there may, uh, physical health, finances, career, um, marriage and family therapy, anything like that, please do consult professionals. If you require that assistance, I am not a professional in those areas. Hostilities, Ten of Cups and King of Cups. Someone is worried about your stability, your happy life, your finances, your abundance, what is coming in for you. I feel like it's as a result of something that you are putting out. This Ten of Cups and King of Cups is giving me reciprocation energy with the universe okay eight of cups i just saw injustice this could be someone that has walked away from you in the past or someone you walked away from that is now outside of uh your energy and i feel like this urgency that i had to even get into this read this person is 
waiting for something. Temperance is on the bottom of the deck with the magician. I feel like this person could have tried to create some type of situation and now they're waiting to see if it's working, if you are in fact getting this Ten of Cups, what is happening? This person's in their head. What's the waiting game? Yeah. Ace of Wands in the reverse and Ten of Pentacles. Okay. This person is waiting to see if what they have done is going to turn your new opportunity or situation from you upside down or block that. Okay. Again, the moon is here. So this person is worried about your stability. Ten of Pentacles in the upright, Ten of Cups in the upright, Ace of Wands in the reverse. So I feel like this person is wanting a new opportunity with you to be in a Ten of Pentacles or Ten of Cups family dynamic with you or some type of partnership with you. But the Ace of Wands is in the reverse. I feel like whatever this person tried to do to control or manipulate a situation, it's not working. And this person is looking for some type of evidence about what's happening Right now, this person's current energy is mental conflict and emotional loss. Concerning a Queen of Cups or King of Cups, okay? What is emotional loss? Temperance. This person is... I feel like this is temperance that's coming out. This person's not patiently waiting. They're impatient. They're very antsy right now. Okay. They're very defensive right now with the seven of wands. And they're just looking, waiting, hoping, wishing three of wands for some opportunity. Okay. Or some type of sign that, that they could still connect with you. I feel this is giving the energy of some type of... Uh, illusion spell with the magician coming out twice why am i seeing the magician chariot chariot six of pentacles ten of wands yes so this person is wanting to come towards you for this reciprocation energy this person wants you to give to them okay right now this person's in the ten of wands okay a a lot of burdens, emotional loss, and they're just waiting to know. I feel like also this person could have tried to put you in a Ten of Wands and try to siphon off your gifts in some way. I asked about the Magician, Three of Swords on the bottom of the deck, they could have sent something to you to have you in Heartbreak and Ten of Wands energy. I'm thinking of something like a illusion illusion spell to swap energy swap destinies to replace your ten of cups ten of pentacles with their ten of wands and four of swords but this didn't work ace of wands in the reverse mental conflict what's mental conflict the hangman they're stuck right now Wheel of Fortune on the bottom of the deck, okay? Stuck fantasizing about your destined path, your dharma or karma, and their karma, okay? Beneath that is the world card. Something has ended or something is coming to an end, or they're also seeing what you are doing, okay? And the justice card is here. What else for mental conflict in the hangman? The sun. Something is being illuminated to you. This could be this message or something will be illuminated to you about this person. That is, we had this four of wands in the reverse at the beginning of the read. It is now in the upright. What is the sun? 
nine of pentacles in reverse okay this is this person that's trying to swap situations with you to be in a wealthy state you could be in the nine of pentacles right now this person is not and this the star in the reverse this person is trying to it looks like take on your destiny be you okay who is this nine of pentacles in reverse judgment on the bottom of the deck the nine of pentacles in the reverse is a five of wands to the lovers this could be an ex-lover that's in competition with you in conflict with you okay but while i feel like they are in competition and conflict with you i feel like they also want to be with you this is all clarifying mental conflict judgment on the bottom of the deck how does this person feel about the collective how does this person feel about the collective the hermit This person has hidden emotion for you with the moon, okay? This person could be secretly watching something you're doing with the hermit in the moon, secretly admiring what you are doing. This person could feel like you're very smart, um, an old soul. This person also feels like you're very uh, successful with the queen of pentacles, and this person wants to be a part of it or they want to end it for you. Either they want you in the five of wands with them or they want to be in the ten of cups or ten of pentacles with you. What is the outcome here, Holy Spirit? The strength in reverse. Okay, whatever this person is trying to do by force. It's not going to work for them. Show me the collective. I feel like you're not even focused. Yeah, six of swords. You've moved on. Okay, you're not really focused on this person. Ace of swords, that's the truth. Okay, you see the truth of this person. You've already moved on. I went again right back to ace of swords. There's something here on the Ace of Swords. What's the Ace of Swords? The High Priestess, okay? So you could be a High Priestess. You could already have knowledge about this person or this situation, okay? You've been made aware something about this person concerning, being concerned with your wish fulfillment or this person you being this person's wish fulfillment. Why is the high priestess here? Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, this person could be somebody that is not grounded. This person could be uh, concerned about money, not having a lot of finances on hand. This person could be interested in connecting with you to simply for financial gain, okay? Anything else here on the Ace of Swords? The Wheel of Fortune and the Emperor in reverse, okay? So this part, person is experiencing some type of karma. This person, I heard this person is wanting to ride the wave. This person is wanting to ride your wave, okay? But this person, Four of Swords, has not done the work. And this person is... This person actually didn't do the work on your connection either. And that is why this person is now grieving. Okay. And justice is here. We've already saw judgment. Let's see what's here. I'm being guided to the Kipper. Okay. We have toil and labor with the lovers as I split it. So I feel like this person, again, may want to work with you now. But I feel like since you have moved on, this person is working on, there's a main male here. This person is working on trying to stop something or cause delays for you. What is this energy here, Holy Spirit? 
what should we be aware of? Official person in the reverse. Thoughts. This is this person concerned, mental conflict energy heavy, mental imprisonment energy heavy. Okay, poverty. And the privileged lady, okay? This person is stuck on you. Whether you are a male or female, and whether this person is a male or a female, they are stuck on somebody that they feel is, this is falling right on top of this queen of pentacles. This person feels like you are well established and they want to be a part of that. They want to reap the benefits. They want to be a part of your community or family, okay? This person feels like you have a lot of unexpected income coming and they want a part of it, okay? So if they can't get it by connecting with you, they're planning on taking it. This person may have wanted to marry you. This person could have proposed to you or been wanting to propose to you. something significant about a house and a court case. This person could have done something in your name to get a house, okay? But there are some changes coming up. What's Thief here? Why is Thief here? Yeah, changes coming up concerning this person and their objectives. This person could be connected to a main female or this main female could be you. This person is now in despair. This person is concerned with you connecting with a wealthy man and marrying a wealthy man or marrying a wealthy woman. In courthouse here. This person is very concerned. There's a lot of concerned energy here. There's something in this deck here. Yeah, look at this. Financial center. This person is really concerned about money. Okay? And living space, living room, okay? A home is con is significant and money is significant. What else should we be aware of concerning this message? mountain okay this is giving the energy of obstacles this person is dealing with a lot right now in the desert it's like this person is feeling like they're alone like this is a very dry season for them and they are trying to find a way went right back to financial center to resolve this issue okay also i just saw a fuel station I feel like your energy is also significant, okay? Oof. This is giving the energy of a tower. In court, okay? I feel like there's going to be an outcome that's going to have this person in despair. Concerning money, a home... And court situation. This person could be doing a lot of drinking right now. This person is afraid that they might be going to jail for something that they've done. This person could also be trying to flee to escape the situation. What is scorching lands? Why is scorching lands here? Window. Okay, I feel like this is the energy of expectation, looking out for something. This is where the read started, like waiting for something to happen, waiting for some type of news, okay? And this news is going to determine whether this person gets on this train or if they stick around, okay? With hotel, this person could be having to move to a hotel or this person could be hiding out at a hotel. Again, court is showing up. Let me get another tarot deck, y'all. Hold on. All right, y'all. Let's see what's going on here. I split the deck on five of 
pentacles and two of wands okay this is a plotting energy or wanting to go in a different direction okay because of lack of finances there's a heavy energy of desperation concerning finances Knight of Cups and Five of Pentacles. I feel like this person is wanting to come towards you again. We saw the chariot because this person is in despair. Five of Cups, we have despair out here as well. What else should we be aware of? Okay. I'm being guided to clarify these. What is scorching lands? What is scorching lands? Justice, yeah. This is clarifying scorching lands. So this is like a tower that's coming in in the form of some type of legal situation. We saw the court card coming out twice. Bottom of the deck, four of wands where we started, okay? I feel like there's something to do with a home and some type of injustice that took place that is about to be discovered. Some type of decision this person made in the past concerning a home. They took quick action, Knight of Swords, and did something. Okay, and now this person is concerned. Okay, it may have had to do something with a relationship, uh, someone you were in a Two of Cups relationship with. Again, this could be an ex of yours. Why is the justice here? Why is the justice here? Oh my goodness, Four of Wands, the same card. Okay, so that is a definite confirmation about a home. Why is window here? What is this expectation energy? Too many. Six of swords. This person is waiting. Like I said, we saw the train. I feel like this person is waiting for some type of news to determine whether or not they're going to flee. Okay, they're going to try to leave. Um, wow. To create some type of escape. This person feels like whatever this is could end them potentially or send them to jail. Yeah, this person's heartbroken about a decision, two of swords. And this could be also them being heartbroken about either blocking you in the past or you blocking them. A decision to walk away. We saw the Eight of Cups. This person is just really going through a Four of Cups. How does this person feel about the collective? How does this person feel about the collective now? I just heard a door close. This person wants the Two of Cups. I just heard a door close and I feel like this person feels like the, the opportunity is gone. The door has closed, okay? With this Queen of Cups, and if you notice, the Queen of Cups is sticking out. The King of Cups is here, okay? I feel like this person feels like you're out of touch. You're out of reach, okay? devil energy this person is really obsessed and anxious <sighs> heavily burdened what is the outcome here holy spirit what is the outcome of this situation i heard you are protected you can count on it you are protected your guides are watching everything that's taking place right now. What is the outcome here? Whatever plots that this person is trying to do, whatever plans they're trying to make are not going to work. Two of Wands in the reverse. 
page of wands you're going to be receiving a message with the sun card down here about this situation being laid to rest for you queen of cups okay This devil energy is going to be in this despair. That's the outcome. Ace of Swords that just flew out. That's the truth. And truth and clarity is coming to you. And the door just closed again. As I said, that's the truth. Okay, that's a confirmation for you, Empress or Emperor. This card is just upright, sticking, sitting on top of this deck. Okay, garden, floral. Okay, something about flowers. I feel like this person may be thinking about sending you some flowers. Or wanting to bring you some flowers. What's on this flowers? Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. This person is definitely wanting to bring you some flowers but you are being protected from this person okay you are already defensive about this person but you're being protected so i don't feel with the chariot in reverse i don't feel like this person will be able to come towards you confirmation yeah however this person is in their head about that decision that's a confirmation okay so let's get you some advice you don't have to worry about this person trying to come towards you you are protected seven of wands what is the outcome here what is the advice for our loved one anger on the bottom of the deck this could be this person's energy we have criticism and mindful natural observation okay i feel like this is the advice for this person to really take a close look at themselves i feel like this person is trying to place some type of blame on you wanting you to take some type of responsibility for the actions that they chose okay this person I do not feel like you are responsible for what happened with this person. This person wants to be in your head, wants you to be in mental conflict so that you will not be in this energy of happiness with this Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. Okay, but this person is facing a situation as a result of their choices. Happiness. Happiness does not come from material gains or the pursuit of perfection. It comes from within. It shouldn't be treated as a target or goal, but rather as an ongoing process. We each have the power to nurture our own happiness, and this can come from leading an open, honest, and loving life, as well as learning to take control of our own emotions and actions and stay mindful of all the good things. Mindful. There are so many things in life to be happy about. I choose to be happy in this moment. Okay, so this is exactly what I thought it was. This person needs to be, needs to take time to observe their own behavior and understand the reason why they are facing the situations that they're facing right now. They need to take ownership and do the inner work so that they can be potentially able to get into this place of Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. That was the read, y'all. I hope that you enjoyed it. If so, please hit the like button, share, subscribe, join the family. Keep doing what you are doing to get to your place of your Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. Okay, show gratitude, be grateful, and that is all that we can do. Um, be aware of your surroundings. Be aware of this person that's trying to contact you, of what their objectives are. Use your intuition. We had the moon out here. Um, 
and the Queen of Cups, King of Cups, which are both very intuitive people. And we have the High Priestess as well. So I feel like you are already aware of this and you are taking all the precautions. If you are in need of a meditation, check out the Lightworks goodie bag if you'd like to. There are some really good meditations there. They're free. Just be mindful of what you choose to use. I'm not responsible for how it affects you. So be sure that you are comfortable with whatever you decide to use. If you feel inclined to donate, which is always greatly appreciated and very helpful to the channel, my information for donations as well as to book personal readings is in the description box. I love you so much, family. Um, enjoy the rest of your day or evening, wherever you are in the world. I'm going to go ahead and clear this energy out before I close it. <laughs> By accident, I split the deck right here on Destiny, okay? So this is the destined path for you and not for this person. They're guiding me to shuffle through these just to shift the energy. Archangel Michael, please clear the energy in the space. Remove any negative energy that may be lingering we return this energy to you to be transmitted into love light and positivity please and thank you until next time family peace and blessings have a beautiful day